In Romans chapter 2, well, it, it's all about judging others that can't keep the law, that don't live by the rules, that, you know, don't find themselves keeping feasts and festivals. It's the Jewish people kind of judging the Gentiles. And Paul goes on to explain it's, a, it's about the heart. It's about lifestyle. It's not about rules. It's not about regulations. In fact, in Romans chapter 2, verse 5 and 6, I want to read this passage to you. But in accordance with the hardness in your impotent heart, you are treasuring up for yourself wrath in the day of wrath and revelation, the righteousness and judgment of God, who will render to each one according to his deeds. So Paul talks about the heart and he talks about lifestyle. God's not so much looking for rules and regulations and keeping all the laws of the Jews, but he's looking at the heart. He's looking at faith and he's looking at lifestyle. In fact, when Jesus began his ministry, if you remember, in the city of Nazareth, he went into the synagogue and he opened the scroll of Isaiah. And he says, I have been sent to preach the good news to the poor. And then he describes at the very beginning who the poor are. He says, to heal the brokenhearted. So God looks for those whose hearts are broken because they know they're sinners, because they know they've done wrong. And he pours in his grace and his mercy into a broken heart. And they live with a heart of faith and life and gratitude. Not one of rules, regulations, but they serve the Lord and know the Lord because their heart's been healed and they live a life of gratitude to him.